Hi, my name is Andrew Draney. My programming partner is Jeff Hudson, and we're going to show you our golf scorecard. To start off, um, here's a little bit of background of what it is. So it's going to support up to one to four golfers and simultaneously track the strokes, putts, out of bounds shots, hazard shots, and number of holes being played. The program has name, yardage, and par information stored for three courses from St. George, Utah. As the golfer runs the runs the program, they will input the names of the players, how many holes are being played, and if they are playing the front nine or the back nine, they get to choose uh, from the three courses. The program outputs the yardage and par for each hole, and then a menu is output with options to add a stroke, add putt, amongst others. The final output of the program is going to print out a scorecard, just like your standard scorecard would for a golf course, with all of the information that would be expected. Now we're going to jump over to the code, and I'll see you there. And here we are. All right, first it's going to ask us how many golfers are going to be joining. Uh, we're going to do two. Not 23. All right. Now it's going to ask for my name, Andrew Draney. And then it's going to ask for my partner's name, which is going to be Jeff. There we go. All right, now we get to choose the course. Uh, I'm going to choose Coral because Coral is my favorite in St. George. And it's going to ask how many holes we want to play. And we're just going to go with a standard nine. And now we get to choose the front or back nine. And let's play the front nine today. That sounds like fun. So it's going to outprint the whole information here, the yardage and the par. And the cool thing about this program is that the user can't break it by inputting any numbers or letters that don't actually do anything. So that's a pretty neat function. And now we're going to start playing. So I'm going to, so I would supposedly take my stroke and then I'll add a stroke here and it'll tell me my current strokes and it's a par five so let's do another stroke one more stroke and it'll just keep telling me what they are now we're on the green a putt another putt and it's going to show me the putts and the strokes and I'm playing pretty well today I just got par so now we've got two options in order to access Jeff and we can either switch player or go to the next player. We're gonna start by going to the next player. And now we're playing as Jeff. And he's uh, gonna start off okay, but he's gonna hit an out of bounds, unfortunately. And then he's gonna hit a hazard shot, unfortunately. And he is gonna make it to the green and he's gonna do a one putt in for the hole. So he's sitting at six, which is just one over par. Now we're going to go to the next hole. And we don't see that option here, but we've got more menu options and it's gonna display next hole or end game. We're going to go to the next hole, and it'll ask make sure we're ready. We are ready. We're going to go to the next hole. All right, now we're playing as Jeff, and we can just add some strokes. We'll add three strokes, and then some putts. And then now we're going to use the other function, which is switch player, and this will display the names. And there we go. We're going to switch to me, and I'm going to hit him out of bounds, hit another one out of bounds, then a hazard, and then three putts because I'm having a bad second hole. And then we're going to go to the next hole, and I'm just going to fill in the rest of this information and not bore you with it. So I'll see you in just a sec. All righty, I went ahead and filled out the rest, and as we are uh, ready to move on to the next hole, since it's the last, it's going to outprint our scorecard here. And you can see here we are right here. And you'll see I just gave up on that hole. I didn't. I hate that hole, so I don't play it. And there we are. It's going to list the, our total strokes and putts off to the right side. It's got all the course information. And that is what our golf scorecard does. Thank you for watching.